Welcome to the SAGE CRM Video On Demand series. In today's session, we are going to provide an overview of customer relationship management to better help you understand how and why it fits in your organization. We're going to start at the beginning, define CRM as it is today. There are three areas of CRM that help bring it to the forefront of your organization. Those are methodology, culture, and technology. Some questions to help you think, do I need CRM? An overview and contact details. The traditional definition of CRM has its roots in the Rolodexes and business card boxes of the world. Contact management software started to appear in the early 80s to track business contacts, phone, email, addresses, and other basic details. Primarily, these softwares were focused on tracking individuals, existing customers, and people with whom they interact on a regular basis, hence the name Customer Relationship Management. CRM was born, but quickly the acronym did not fit the mold. No longer does CRM represent primarily customers, but CRM at its core is about all interactions organizations have, internal and external. Remove the C from CRM and you have the core of these technologies. Relationship management is the ability to understand each and every interaction involved in successful and not so successful transactions. Whether it is tracking interactions involved in a successful sale or every touch point in a legal action, relationship management is at the center. As you can see here, we have a list of all communications for an organization called Gatecom Incorporated. To give you an idea of how everyone that interacts with this organization is involved, let's take a look. As you can see the highlighted area, we had an engineer go out to replace a component on April 18th. The sales team was working in conjunction on another opportunity with this organization and send them an updated quote. They followed up by faxing the quote to the customer per their request. The executive team in our organization contacts all existing customers to introduce themselves, say hello, and build that relationship. That is tracked here. The consulting team followed up after a demonstration to make sure they had answered all questions and that the decision makers were involved in the process. A brochure letter was sent. So marketing contacts are also tracked within the communications. And as you can see on the right hand side, the paperclip represents an attachment. If the customer were to call your organization, say they just got this great brochure, anyone who answers the phone can click, click on the paperclip and review that verbatim. Our customer success team has an annual golf tournament. As you can see here, they were invited and we followed up. The finance team sent an invoice to this organization. And as we do to ca collect cash more efficiently, we follow up with emails reminding them that the invoice is on its way. The methodology behind CRM involves people, process, technology, metrics, analysis, and adjustment. CRM methodology is an ongoing learning and adaptation process to better understand everyone your organization deals with and how each interaction is a successful one, or at the very least, we improve upon previous interactions. The culture of CRM is a commitment by the people in the organization that a common goal is to be achieved. That goal is to use improved communication and tools to create an excellent experience for all involved. Consistency, accuracy, accountability, efficiency, availability, reliability, and trust can all be developed through this method 
but what must be understood is that none of the above characteristics describe technology. Customer relationship management technology is a central repository to house all interactions, communications, and appropriate information and make it accessible to internal employees, external partners, customers, and prospects, making the process of helping each other easier and an excellent experience worth talking about. Ask yourself just a few of these questions. Would improving each and every interaction we have internally and externally make us a better organization? If my staff can accomplish 75 tasks in a day instead of only 55, and those tasks are performed more efficiently, are we a better organization? Remember, CRM is just an acronym. Research Relationship Management. Research technologies that help improve communications, such as Sage CRM. Simplify the concepts that you see around the CRM market space to better understand how this technology can help your organization. Remember, the value can be found at its core, communications and interactions and the human experience. Technology will not force your people to use the system. People have to want to improve. The organization has to want to improve. Every organization can benefit from relationship management, including yours. Thank you for joining us today in the Sage CRM Video On Demand series. Here are our contact details if you have any further questions about CRM in your organization. Have a great day.